and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of 12 Minutes. So, in the previous episode, we found out quite a lot of things and uh, a couple of reveals that, well, actually was very smartly played by the developers. So... If you haven't seen the episode, uh, go and check it out because, damn, it's storytelling at its finest. So, we are the ones that killed our wife's father and we are also the one who oh, is called the monster the the or switch. her half-brother because her nanny was having an affair with her father and the nanny is our mother so yeah you figure that out that's actually quite a twist so we found out all of that and we had two um, two loops where we were freaking out and there was a backstory of how we killed uh, her dad hey i finally remember and the spirit key outside. the uh, what was i going to say Thunder. the loop I is still continuing so we are definitely not um we're not done here even though we found out basically everything so we are actually trying to figure out how to break the loop but if I had to wager we just have to confess I'm stuck in a time loop and I can prove it <laughs> right <laughs> look how your father died it's not what you think. I know how he really died. What are you doing? It was a heart attack. No, it wasn't. It was Christmas Eve. He caught you sneaking out, and he hit you. How could you know that? I couldn't. You told me in a previous loop. I did what? Listen, listen. he didn't die when you shot him. What are you doing? He survived. Your brother, the one you always called Monster. He killed him a week later. I have a fucking brother? A half-brother from your father's affair. He's the one who did it. That Polaroid from the coffee shop, it proves it wasn't you. What is going on? I know. <sighs> All right, there's more. Listen, a man is about to ring the doorbell. He's going to accuse you of murder, but he's actually just here for your father's pocket watch. What? His daughter has cancer, and the watch will pay for the treatment. Uh, what? He was close to your father, and when your dad died, it really hit him hard. Yeah. Um, why am I not admitting it? Oh, here it is. Tell I don't her know how to say this. I've forgotten a lot really of things happened. that... I'm just remembering now. Things that, if I could go back, I would have done differently. What are you talking about? Oh... Uh... Okay, let, let's go... Maybe from your father's affair. What about her? her name With the brother Diana. option. She was my mother. What? Your dad found me after your mother passed. It's me. I'm your brother. What are you saying? It was you? You killed him? And then? Oh my god, I'm going to be sick. I, I can't handle this. Why? After all this time? Um... I'm not sure what to say because I mean it wasn't on purpose because the father actually assaulted us but still you we are her brother so it's kind of a mixed bag it's not so much white and black or whatever so Ah, huh. okay, let's go with it wasn't it my was fault. It was him or me. And you just forgot to mention it. You, you're fucking disgusting. I am 
so sorry. Sorry? Hey, you married me. I'm pregnant with your baby. You animal. I just, I, I forgot it all. Somehow, I, I don't know how, but I did. And if I could go back, baby, you are my only family. I love you. I love you so much. Don't you fucking dare. You fucking liar. I'm trying to tell you the truth right now. And you, look, you, you've been lying. Oh, you're blaming me now? No, no, I, I, look, I'm just. Fuck you. I'm leaving. Don't be here when I come back. Holy, open up. <sighs> ah, crap, I forgot to. Fuck you. Die alone in a fire. I'm with the police. Turn around, please. Wait, stop. I have something you need to see. What did you say? My husband just confessed. He's the killer. He's the monster that- Enough. You're under arrest. Please, just listen to me. Why would I listen to you? You're a murderer. M my husband. Tell him. Your husband, come on. I'd listen to someone who doesn't have a vested interest in you being innocent. Not your husband. That's enough. Hold still. <sighs> so... No, it's... I'm not in your liquor. I didn't do that. <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna see how this plays out. Don't move. Help me. Will you come help me? Look, 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 look. look. I'm not resisting. Uh, 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 I don't know. This is a mess. And there's a piece of evidence I need. I know it's here. He's the one. He killed my father. Tell him. Just tell me where the watch is. You're only making it worse. You're not listening. I didn't kill him. Where's the watch? Fine. Just take it. It's in the bathroom vent. Under the cabinet. Guess I don't need you anymore, partner. I don't know. This is a mistake. Oh, babe, who you tell him? This is a misunderstanding. Look, I... I don't know. You don't have to handcuff me. We can talk this out. And... Good loop. Alright, it's getting easier. Okay, so... I am going to try and talk to the wife after I've calmed down the cop. And I'm gonna try the other dialogue options and see where it goes from there. Hey, please. Um. Wait. Listen. I'm the one who killed the old man. It was me. What are you talking about? This isn't funny. Lose my number. Oh, damn. I think I messed that up. <laughs> Not now. Okay. There are things, things that if... Look, it was me. I'm the man who killed your father. What kind of sick joke? Look, his office is filled with books, all the way up to the ceiling. I never forgot how weird that looked. What, what are you... No, no. You've been hiding this from me, lying to me all these years. You... How could you? Oh, okay, now I have more... ...options. Okay. It's all my fault, all of it. I should have told you. God, you're my only family. I couldn't lose you. If I could go back, I'd fix this. Go back? If you could go fucking back. I'm having your child. I'm sorry. Oh, you're sorry? That makes it better. Jesus. There's a cop coming here. He's gonna try and arrest you. What? How do you even... We don't have much time. Look, I can't undo what I've done, but I'll clear your name. I'll confess. Who are you? Just let me try to fix this, please. I ruined everything, but you deserve to have a life. You're disgusting. Fine. We'll wait. Hey. 
We are not talking. Okay. actually reverting time now that I actually take it in my hands. We can actually see the books in the watch itself. I didn't notice hey, that before. There he is. You're back. <sighs> Look, I know this is a terrible shock, but we need to be on the same page. These feelings for my daughter, your sister. Look, I. This isn't how I wanted to tell you. You deserve, both of you deserve better. You know, the thing I hate the most, worst thing in the world, disappointed my little girl. Well, that was the worst thing. And now a baby, you with your little love, I guess it was always gonna happen. Hey, it's only by forgetting that we ever really dropped the thread of time and approached the experience of living in the present moment. <sighs> You read that one, I... I know the idea of forgetting things sounds crazy, but what if you could? I can help with that if you want. All you have is the future. You'll forget everything you went through. All the pain, all the stress, forgotten. Forever. But you need to understand, there is no turning back. You can't undo this. We can talk about it still. You can choose an answer. You don't have to forget if you don't want to. The choice is yours. This is your last chance. All right. I hope you find what you're looking for. All right. Close your eyes. I want you to think of a flower. Focus, breathe, look at its contours, its curves. Now I want you to imagine it changing, moving backward, returning to its bud. Think of that bud, unopened and fresh and new. Look at it as a whole. Don't just notice the changes. Trippy. I thought it would be a longer game than that. I actually wanted to see the day play out uh, as it should, but not in a flashback kind of way. But yeah, the story is good. Can't deny that. 
Definitely a game that's unlike any other. If I phrase that right, probably I did. I don't know. Um, but yeah, uh, when you first start out in the game, you're like disoriented and don't know what to do. And then small pieces of the puzzles just fall into your lap bit by bit and loop after loop. And it actually makes you think, but I didn't believe that this section would uh, be the end. I actually kind of preferred, her, uh, preferred the ending where um, the cop gets the uh, watch and everyone is more happy, but I know that that probably isn't the point since this is probably the redemption story or more like um damn i'm at a loss for words uh a purgatory for the husband because he did all of that messed up uh stuff and he killed her his wife's father so this was kind of his purgatory and coming to terms with his past and remembering it all but definitely a very cerebral game and I definitely dig it. I might actually uh, pick up some more games like this um, and try and give them a spin. But definitely it, it left an impact. Nice uh, voice work and Definitely the tensions between the voice actors and they really made it believable. Well, of course, it's A-list actors doing the voice work, so duh, it's gonna be good. So, can't actually complain about that. But I wonder if there's an alternate ending to this. I may actually try and go for another spin for myself and see if I can actually get another ending to it. But yeah, definitely an awesome game and I definitely recommend it for everyone who didn't uh, have a chance to play and support your indie developers. They are the new rising stars in this cesspool of AAA developers that sucks the money and blood from all of its uh, gamers. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, if you like what you saw in this video or the entire playthrough, consider subscribing, like the content, Hit me with a comment or two, I'll be definitely replying to all of them, and I will be seeing you next time. Sayonara dudes and dudettes, and have a happy, happy day.